<clears throat> hello, hello, hello. Okay, we're here for a lunchtime box opening. There's a chance I'll get interrupted. Uh, that's okay, we can always edit it together. Um, I alluded on my wall that there was a box opening today and she has arrived uh, all the way. Well, okay, so it's a girl. All the way from Russia. And I'm gonna get straight to it and then I can tell the story about how this baby came to be added to my collection once she's opened or if I am good at multitasking as we go because I always make a long process of talking before I get to opening and I don't want to do it. I'm going to cater a little bit towards those that just want to get to the baby. So this baby, uh, the box feels a little bit uh, smashed up at the bottom, but it wasn't open. Well, maybe it was open and retaped. I don't know. She made it safely, you guys. Doesn't seem to be bad enough to be damaged. We're going to see. There we go. This doll, I, I mean, I, I would say it was. Less than two weeks since she made it here. So, not too, too bad. Sent e oh, upside down. Sent EMS. So, walked through the postal service. And had no hiccups on the US side. I mean, sat in New York for just a few days, but nothing major. So, uh, let's open the box. Okay. I can see her face right there. She has no like face covering, but let's see this box. Let me take this stuff out of the box because the flap is kind of in the way. Oh my gosh, she's just right here. Maybe. And I'm thinking I'm gonna get to the baby first. And then those of you who want to stick around for the goodies will get to that. If I can, I've got bubble wrap stuck to the gift box. It just completely destroyed the gift box. But yeah, let's do that. Let's get to the baby first, and then we'll get to the stuff. I almost never do that. But I cannot wait to see her. I absolutely cannot wait to see her. So. <laughs> And it's not going to take much for us to open her. Oh, we have a, a hair thing. Seems to have fallen out. All right, well, I have this set up on the desk thinking you could get a higher view, but I can't really see exactly what's going on. Okay. Well, we'll just roll with it. So first of all, Here's her little legs. Look at this little hip sticking out the side. Oh my gosh, she is already adorable and I haven't even seen her yet. I saw pictures, of course. Don't see a lot of this sculpt around. So her left foot, all the toes are all curled up. The painting is really nice. And she's um, matte varnish. Not too heavy, but definitely can feel it. Very beautiful, soft painting style. I haven't had a doll by this artist yet. <laughs> I see her face. Here's one hand. Look at this pretty little dress she's in. She's wearing a size three diaper. Oh yeah, her hair's down. She is. All right, I'm just gonna lift it up so we can see her face. Oh, your hair came down. <laughs> it's all staticky. Hello. Hello, cutie. I'm gonna have to fix this. Let's get the plastic off of her. Hi. She's so funny. Wow, her hair, my hair used to get like this as a kid. It's just flying all over the place. Some bubble wrap, Jackie. I think I'll get a little conditioning spray just to 
calm down the static for her. <laughs> Watch out. Yes, you can have, you can have that if you like it. Her hair is extremely soft and, um, you know, not dry at all, but just want to calm down the static here. She's got some, some winter flyaways. She even has a little like blemish right below her, under her hair here. Well, well, we'll get her hair done perfectly after, but I just want to get this back in so we can see her look and then we'll tell you about her. Hi, cutie. So this sculpt, I think your paperwork's right here. This baby, this artist that I got this baby from has made, I would have to say, maybe six versions of this sculpt and every single one of them that I saw, I loved and thought about buying. I've talked to her. I even found a collector locally who has like four or five from her and was selling one to get another doll from this artist. And I just hesitated each time and missed out. But I just always thought about her and, and thought, um, one night I was sitting there in my bed and I thought about it again. And I was like, dang it. You know, the last time I talked to her, about one was back in November and I knew I had, you know, missed the boat on that doll again because that's a long time ago. So I just contacted her and I said, look, I regret not buying this doll. Do you have any more kits? And she did. And she said she would make a custom for me. She said it would take about three to four months. It did not take anywhere close to that. And you guys, this hair is micro rooted beautifully and she did it in two and a half days i i don't know if she sleeps or what okay so we'll have to do a little touch on her eyelashes too they look like they got pushed down but so this baby let's tell you who she is <laughs> i kind of want to sit her up we won't be able to see her we'll have to <gasps> there she is this is the girl i know So here's her paperwork. I feel like not a lot of pomp and circumstance just getting right to the baby, but I was just ready to see her. <laughs> here's her little folder. Let's see. All right. So she was born on March 17th, 7th, March 7th. So today is March 18th. So March 7th to March 18th delivered from Russia. And the artist is Yulia Bobkovka, Bob, Bobkova, excuse me, Yulia. And here is her little certificate. This is the Petya kit. Number 255 out of 400. Interesting how it's printed. Um, she, yeah, 255 or 400. Very interesting COA. <laughs> I've seen this. This is um, Shailen Maxwell's version, Reborn Sweet. The eyes look funky because of the way these are printed, but she did one of the prototypes. Yes, yeah, so here she is. So I've so it's been a while. Like I said, I've reviewed multiple versions of her kit and from this artist and she just she always makes them kind of like a toddler girl even though she's little. And something about her just just gets me. So let's slide her back a little bit. <laughs> Look at how cute she is. She's perfect. How cute is this baby, you guys? Oh my goodness. 
Well, let's get her goodies and open them up. Put that on the desk here. Very nice box opening too. Well, she had a little hair clip. It looks like it got busted in transit though. We'll have to get her some little clips. It's a little, um, I wonder if this was in her hair. A little butterfly clip. <laughs> All right, so looks like we have a blanket. Yeah, it's a nice blue like felt blanket for her. And what is this? This is Mampa. Oh my goodness. Don't even tell me. It's chocolate with caramel in the middle. How nice is this little chocolate package? My goodness. You wanna hold my chocolate? Okay, and then she's got a little rattle toy and a comb. <laughs> and, yeah, and a comb. And then a little outfit here. This is the thing that got all destroyed with the tape sticking to it. I bet you the hair clip maybe was in here. Okay, so. We have a beautiful headband, white and blue. And then really cute uh, baby go made with love. It's like an aqua color polka dotted onesie collared um, with a kitty cat on the chest and her little pacifier lovey <laughs> and her pink polka dotted pants. Oh my goodness, is she just so cute. And I already had a name for her. I'm just gonna tell you her name because why not? I already have it. She is just so freaking cute. So her name selected with the help of my bestie Ashley of Baby Love Heartsmith, who's always along for the name ride with me and all the baby crazy. Her name is Rooney. Rooney Little is what I'm naming her. Oh my goodness, is she so cute? Look at that little face. I don't like this clip right here. We'll work with the hair. I know I can do a better job of it, but look how sweet she is, you guys. Oh my gosh, look at those gorgeous blue eyes. She is amazing. I love her. She's exactly what I thought. Exactly what I thought she would be. I was just snapping the photo. All right, guys, so here's little Miss Rooney Little. Rooney, welcome to the nursery. I see all the babes in the back. Um, we are really glad that you're here talking to her. I'm really glad that you guys are here um, to check her out. I hope you think she's cute. Let me know what you think. I'll put the artist name in the description below and the kit name and all that. Um, but we're gonna hop back over to the rest of our day and also she's gonna sit right here on the desk with me today while I work. Um, sending out lots of love to you guys. Bye for now.